What's up guys and gals? So check it out. I got this package today. No, just kidding. Uh, <laughs> I saw a clown fire today. He came with me uh, on some errands. Uh, keep this closed for a second. Um, and you know, of course, we had a, like a little toy run. But he also gave me an early birthday present. So pretty cool. You know, big thanks to the homie Clownfire, Adrian, aka Clownfire. Uh, for those of you who aren't familiar, so those of you who are, you know, who re regularly watch my stuff, you know, you're you're probably familiar with him. Uh, you know, he's my friend here that we go on toy runs and stuff. I actually have a, several videos of toy runs we've went on, but I haven't edit those videos yet because it's a bunch of little little clips and you know I get lazy to throw those all together in one video but anyway so it gave me a little early birthday present pretty cool so let me show you guys what he gave me cool wrapping you know target bag don't get more special than that <laughs> uh, so here we go First of all, uh, you know what, let's say that, I mean, as if you can't see them already, but let's let's start off with this. It's an X Games fingerboard, and you know, I'm all about like skulls and sculling crossbones and stuff like that. So this is a cool one. Um, I've never actually tried fingerboarding. Uh, I think I would totally suck at it, and no amount of practice would help me get better. But, you know, this is cool. I'm gonna give it a shot anyway. Let's check it out. That's cool. Got the skull on the deck right there. Uh, these X Games ones are actually made by Mattel. I didn't notice that before. So that's pretty cool. And then got me the Transformers RPMs roll bar. Really cool because I love that vehicle. Um, if I remember right, is are these the ones that we saw in in Revenge of the Fallen, like early on, like in the um, yeah, there's a Nest logo on there. Um, like in the scene in, in Shanghai, I think this might be the one. Uh, if not, it's very similar. Either way, it's really cool. Uh, I, I, you know, even though this is roll bar, as you can see there, I'd actually want to get a few of these and just use them as the actual nest vehicles and not as a transformer. Uh, so really cool. Thanks for that. Definitely have to find some of those and last but not least oh you know before I show this off he actually also gave me the um, the Hot Wheels Ghostbusters Ecto-1 but I told him he could have it no need because I actually found one um, a few days ago at uh, at Walmart uh, on the day I went um, yeah on the day I went to Anime Expo which was like last Friday uh, I actually went to Walmart real quick before heading off on the on the freeway for that and found the uh, uh, a Batista and uh, the Hot Wheels Ecto-1. So anyway, so check it out. Bam! How cool is that? It's the, the 4 inch scale uh, Spider-Man line. Power Charge Rhino. That's freaking cool. Um, if you're familiar with with what I collect and you know some of my recent videos, I, I I collect, you know, the four-inch scale Marvel, you know, Marvel Universe. Um, you know, uh, it started with Superhero Showdown or Marvel Legends Showdown. Uh, I used to collect Marvel Legends, but I definitely, my main scale is is like four-inch, like as you can see here, you know, like G.I. Joe and Star Wars. So. You know, once they started doing the foreigners, that was it for me. It's like perfect. Um, I actually had the Marvel Legends Rhino from a while back, or was it was it one of the six inch Spider Man's line, Spider Man lines, or was it actual Marvel Legends? I don't remember. Um, one of the really older ones. It didn't even have like elbow or, or knee articulation. Anyway, so here we have finally, you know, not only in the four inch scale, but you know, really modern version of Rhino. I don't know if this is based on his look in the comics um, or if it's just something that they came up with, you know, took, took uh, liberties with in the design. Like, cause I know like, uh, yeah, yeah. So I, I don't know what I was gonna say there. I got distracted cause I'm like, what are these, these, these things in the back, these battle cards? 
But yeah, so, you know, that's a badass figure. Nice and, and bulky. Um, you know, he's not huge, like, he's not super tall. Uh, let me see if I can get it quick without opening it. Yeah, it's about... So it is, it's still, he's a little taller. Uh, tiny bit taller, which, you know, if the average four inch figure is like six feet tall, he'd be about, um, and he is standing up straight. So he'd be about like seven feet or so, or, or six and a half feet. Um, but he's real bulky. So yeah, uh, <laughs> no, I shouldn't get into detail because I am still gonna, um, review this later on. But yeah, so big thanks to Clownfire for the birthday presents, you know, and there was, like I said, there was also a, a Hot Wheels Ecto-1, but, you know, I let him have it back so he can, he can eBay that bitch, you know, he gonna make some money, <laughs> you know, but it was real cool of him to, to give me these. So, yeah, you know, big thanks, Clownfire, if, if you aren't familiar with his channel, you know, if you're not already subscribed, go ahead and subscribe to him, you know. Uh, link down there in the description box. Uh, cool channel, you know, we, we go on runs together, so, um, and he, well, I, I'm, I, I'm slowing down, because I'm like, man, I need to save money, I need to stop buying toys. Um, so he goes on a lot more runs, and you, uh, if you're subscribed to him, or if you go subscribe to him, you'll see lots of his toy hauls. He gets a lot of stuff, so you know you'll you'll definitely be impre be impressed. Um, so yeah, go check him out. You know, long time friend. Uh, just quick history. Uh, I don't remember what year it was. I think we met like around the 2006 2007 so for those of you you know who are friends of both of us um real quick you know how we met uh I don't, 2000 it was, it was either late 2006 or really early 2007 um we met through a kind of met through a mutual friend because our friend ashley uh was posting a bulletin for for Clownfire because Clownfire was doing a a, a film project for school and he needed people and bad karma I heard you read you saw the video that's pretty embarrassing cuz he was real bad he 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 did no put no effort into making me look less short like in my films and if you saw my mock diesel movie you know a filmmaker can take a short person like Van Damme or Jackie Chan or Jet Li and make them look not so short <laughs> <laughs> I am real short, you know, if you, if, for you, those of y'all that didn't know, I'm only five feet. I've mentioned it, and, you know, uh, either way, you know, uh, it's, it's, it might be hard to kind of visualize, but in his movie, that early movie from, like, I think it was 2007, yeah, you, you can see definitely how short I am back camera. I know, I know you saw that. You probably were laughing, like, this little motherfucker. So, anyway... Yeah, that's how we met. I, I I got on board with that. I played a I played a bum. <laughs> I played the neighborhood, not a complete bum. Well, kinda. I don't know. Why well, watch the movie? I'll, I'll I'll put a link to it in the description box. Also, it's real embarrassing. Um, so yeah, that's that's how we met, and it's been uh yeah. And then we always plan to make make more movies never got around with made airsoft videos he did help me on one of my little short films i did uh saving boo boo which was a little little gift for my um for my girlfriend anniversary present so anyway so that's that yeah big thanks to clown fire hooking it up with the early birthday present i was about to open this up right right now and do a, a review on them but you know what i'm gonna save these so I got something to open on my birthday. So on my, on my birthday, um, I'm gonna have a little opening party, you know, so in case I got some other stuff on my birthday too, you know, I'm gonna have a little opening party. So yeah, watch out for that on my birthday. So for those of you who don't know, uh, I, I'm not gonna say when my birthday is, maybe you'll find out. Um, you know, there are a few people here who do know. Uh, either way, you'll see that on my birthday, I'm gonna have a big ass opening party for all this stuff I get 
uh, if I get any other stuff on my birthday. Well, I do. I, I know I got one thing coming. So thanks in advance to BC. You know. Um, but yeah. Anyway, thanks again, Clownfire. Go check his channel out. And uh, for the rest of y'all, thanks for watching. More videos to come very soon. So sit tight, stay tuned, and thanks.